So here we are in North Carolina and we're just visiting Warren McCormack Photography. Beautiful to be in North Carolina, very warm today. Uh, the studio's here, just had to climb some stairs, it's on the second level. So let's just go and see if Warren's home, hey? Wow, this looks like a nice studio. Hello? Hey! Oh, here he is. Nice to see you. How are you doing? Coming in. Welcome. Yeah, so this is it. This is the big, uh, the big studio, hey? Yeah, my little space, my little, wow, really impressive. It's big. Mm -hmm. Tell yeah. us how long have you been here? So uh, pretty much up to two years, yep. uh, I had a three year lease. Right. It took about six months really to kind of get it renovated and kind of into a place where I could use it. Then you got some products here along the wall? Yep. Been kind of building these up over time and working with you on that. Right. So I'm here. We're going to make some changes today. Yes. Yeah. A bit yeah. nervous about that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, this should be uh, interesting. This, this looks great. Uh, show us some of your products. Like, what's this one doing here? So this is a client order. Yeah. Uh, this is a, a 30 by 30 that's custom framed. And this is one that I recommend. This is called Bernice Collage. Bernice Collage is the 11-up. How and many of these have you sold since I introduced it? Oh my goodness. Well, we sold them as acrylics, probably getting close to 20. Okay. Which and is pretty good. The acrylics over there. Yeah. And this is a canvas. Canvas has started to um, become quite popular. For people that want a little bit more of a traditional approach as opposed to that polished kind of plastic look. Okay. okay, and here you've got a portrait box. Yeah, I love these. Uh, this one is from Global Imaging. It is, yep. Okay, uh, tell us about this. Do you sell many of these? This has just got a couple of prints in. Obviously, you're still working on them. Yeah, so this, we, this is probably like the second best seller. Uh, at the studio. Uh, people love this polished uh, white look. You know, it does come in black as well. Um, the fact that they have these uh, beautiful mats from Australia. And then you put these in. Yeah, the resealable bags. Resealable. That just protects them. Yeah. Um, and it makes all the difference, doesn't it, in presentation. Oh, it's huge. Once you open this up and once you slip that in there. Yeah. So it's what what a there. difference. I'm making this look a lot more awkward than it is. You better do it, Warren. I haven't done this for a few years, right? There you go. But it goes something like that without destroying the print. There you go. Yeah, and without. Just seal it down. That's it. That's great. So I'd suggest with the portrait box in your display, you put them all into those sleeves. I do. I mean. Okay, great. So, oh, you've got some there. Yeah. So this is a client order. They ordered uh, print collection one, which is three matted uh, 8x10s. And so I always tell them, you know, that the mats are imported from Australia, uh, but that the prints are made at a, a professional lab in the US using archival inks. Of course, you know, which is very important. And um, you've got your personalised ribbon. Yeah, I've got this made. I uh, love these. So you just stick that on. Just, just on the corner there. Finishes it off quite just nicely. Finishes off. That's great work. Okay, show us something else. That's your smaller products. Uh, have you got your large canvas? What size is the one of the dogs there? So 60 by 30, so it's a panoramic. Okay. Let's set this down. Yep. Um, and you created that uh, six, five different shots? Six, five. I did. So I photographed that individually and then stitched it together. So the mom had asked the painter to do a painting of all of her dogs. Yeah. Back down a bit. So she told me a story. So on the day of her IPS, I put this together as a surprise. So when she came in and saw it, she got this size. Yeah. So I designed it as that size and she bought it. That's great. Let's go this way. Show us over here. Um, so you're using Profoto Softbox? Uh, I love Profoto. Um, I've used all sorts of products over the years like ABVs and Canon. Nothing wrong with them. But what I love about this is that they're really straightforward to use. For somebody that's not non-technical with the old school way of figuring out lighting patterns, I love that Profoto just uses a simple number. Yeah. You know, it's really easy. The electronic. Yeah, so mm -hmm. let's keep going. We've we uh, got some props there. We've got the two polishing stools, which are a must for me for any studio. 
Uh, the apple boxes, yeah. the ladder or the step, another stool, and these, tell us about these. So the V-flats are good for either bouncing light in or uh, cancelling it out. Just soft light. Yeah, you can like bounce and make it look better. Or... <laughs> Actually, hold it up in front of me, it would look better. <laughs> like this? Yeah. 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 So, um, like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just so, do a cutout. Really yeah. 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 And, and you've got one of these that I never had. I wish I had it. Look at that. Look at oh, the difference that makes. They're amazing. Just look at the light on your face. Um, yeah. Look, 10 years You, young, you should just carry this around with you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, this is fantastic. It's strap there. What, what do you call it? It's, uh, I believe it's called an eye lighter. Eye, eye lighter. But it really so it lights up the light and the shadows under the, the eyes. eyes. That's it. And it puts catch light in the eyes. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah. Fantastic. So you actually get the shape of this. This and usually that. Yeah. In uh, the eyes. Yeah. And it whitens the eyes, of course. It looks really good. It makes the eyes look amazing. It looks very good. And what have we got here? So I've got. <laughs> this is a, a canvas I've had for many years, uh, back in the wedding days. My eight by five, what about eight by four foot canvas? Eight by four feet. Yeah. Wow. Hundred inches. Where'd you get that? I got that Dirty. from uh, Simply Canvas, which is right. now Simply Color Lab. Right. Uh, and then they freight shipped it here. But you can get those. That size now is actually quite available. Uh, I don't think a printer will print any wider, like any taller than that. No, I'm not sure how wide canvas is. I think it will go wide enough. But, yeah. Uh, well, 60 inches is pretty it's good. Nice, that's a nice size. And uh, um, this is a desk here. You've got, um, I'm glad to see you've got the cellophane rolled. Yep. And the cutter. Yeah. And you've got that fill light there. Yeah. So a little work area. So I do make your wrapping here. Yeah. Got the cannon, looks like a tree gun the cannon, the Mark IV. Yeah, I love that thing. Um, and you've got a fridge here for yeah. people to yeah, usually have your lunch. Is that all your usually, lunch? So it's, be, it's kind of being taken over <laughs> with, with my lunch. food. But I usually do have a few drinks in there for clients, you know. Uh, I'll offer them a, you know, a coffee, but honestly, most people just want a cup of water, yeah. which they never finish and they throw away. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so it's usually a little bit more tidier yeah. than this. Well, what's this room here? There's a woman in there. Is that you said that oh, was your sister? That's, that's my silent assistant. Yeah. She's really still. <laughs> yes. Coming out of there. How long have you been there? She hasn't really moved much. You know. She said she was really useful, but I don't believe her. <laughs> oh, I see. You've got something I set up for you here. Yeah. With these clipboards, how are you finding this? So you've got a clipboard for the sessions to come, mm -hmm. the uh, portrait viewings to come, uh, the orders ready to be sent to the lab, is uh -huh. that right? That's it. Those ready for pickup and any that have been rescheduled. How are you finding that process? So, before we did same day IPS, yes. uh, this worked great. This is a tiny adjustment for same day viewings. You, you would just take this bit out unless yep. you're scheduling them for another day. Because so they'd move along the line. You move yep. along the line. And what I love is that if I can't quite remember their names, yeah, I'll just, just come in here it. and go, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's who's here. Right. It's quite handy. And then um, what I love about this, though, is you can get a visual of how things are looking yeah. and then just count them up. So if you've got, if, if yeah. you've got here, like these are your portrait bookings to come yeah. this next week. And then you've got the viewings. Mm -hmm. So you're doing a lot of viewings the same day. Yes. So that's great. So that's why there's not yeah. much there because yeah. these will happen, uh, shoot and sell and so on. Mm -hmm. And uh, a few yeah. bookings there too. Got a few uh, orders. orders. Yeah. Uh, all those are out, are they? Are these all uh, orders? A lot of these, I've got to re kind of tidy it up a little bit, but um, yeah. a lot of these have been done. Waiting, waiting to come back. So what I do is I just, once I'm done with this, I file it away yep. in a folder. Yep. Uh, I may actually move to just scanning them if I need to keep it. Right. That's fantastic. Okay. And that's, that's great. So just come and have a seat here. Okay. And uh, let's just um, talk about your business and, okay. and how you think that your business is going in this sort of environment? It's 
and she's thriving. Uh, um, so if I roll back just over a year ago, because we've been working together for probably about 14, 15 months, I think. Yep, yep. Uh, I never dreamed that I would be a portrait photographer of sorts, you know, and thought maybe do headshots or something. Wedding photographer for many years, 14 years, so a lot of weddings. Um, moving away from that, I never dreamed that my business would actually thrive more mm. by doing portraits. Right. And just forget about weddings. So I just finished my last wedding. I couldn't be happier. Well done. Thank you. And last year I had my best year in business, yeah. which That's is great. mostly to do with doing portraits. After what, six years in business? Uh, 14. 14 years in business. Yeah. You had your best year yes. last year. Yes. That's fantastic. Well, yeah. Well done on that. Thank you. And especially getting out of weddings because it's oh, not hard. It's, it's not easy. I mean, it's hard. It's, it's a lot of work. You know, we do, I do, used to do a lot of destination work. So the last wedding was actually a destination wedding. So you're taking three days out of your schedule to yeah. do that one so day. So where was the destination? It was in Charleston, which is about five hours. I was going to say in China. Was that? It's, not, it's, not far, it's not far away then. It's not too bad, but you've got to get hotels yeah. and travel. Of course. Yeah. You know, pick your assistants up mm. and do all those different things. Fantastic. Yeah. And scout out the new locations. When you're working in a new city, you want to make sure you can get around and you know on the day how you're going to do that. So we always did that the day before drive throughs. Yeah. So just come up here. I want to show you yeah. something. Okay. And something that when I talk to you each week, right? Yeah, as we do our Zoom sessions, and <laughs> you are normally sitting there. That's it, right? Yeah, I'm right there. So you're normally sitting there, and I'm seeing you through there, and I see this photograph all the time, right? This wedding photograph. And what have I said for years about that photograph? It needs to come down. It needs to come down. So should we take him take it down? No, I'll take it. <laughs> so. <laughs> We're going to oh, make a few changes. Awesome. Warren doesn't do weddings anymore. So why would he have a wedding photograph on the wall? Beautiful frame, by the way. Thank We've you. got a brilliant idea what we'll do. We'll get a beautiful, take a beautiful portrait. Okay. And get a canvas done. Yeah. And we'll use this frame up. So yeah. It's just, a beautiful frame. Can we just swap it out? So, so that's what we'll do. And we'll do the same. And if you like, you can do a portrait of me and put it in there and put it back up there, but I don't think so. Okay. Like royalty? <laughs> yeah, sort of like royalty. <laughs> so Bernie. Uh, that's fantastic. So we made a start. We've got a lot of work to do. Yes. Uh, we've had a chat about what we're going to do. And uh, there's so much. This is a beautiful studio. Thank you. But I think there's so much more we can do to take it to that next level, that next really high level. I can't wait. You can't wait? Yeah. Well, Thank let's you, get buddy. it done. Let's do it. Good on you. Thank you.